Slay, where's going? Hey, man, we got secrets and allegations. The rise of a high-ranking gang queen. Before we get in there, bit, make sure you subscribe right now. Nah, ain't gonna do too much talking as you get in. To him. I'm sentenced, I'm dropping my transcript, and I'm just letting people know there's no there's no backtracking. There's there's definitely backtracking. Put in every bad information I don't talk this shit information out of me, there's no coming back. There's no coming back. Like I'm sorry, like I don't want to hear I'm sorry because real niggas deal with paperwork. The best year of my life, but you know, a very sad, sad year for me. And I just wanted to acknowledge and show my appreciation for all my fans and supporters who's been reaching out every family member and friend has been reaching out even though i haven't been able to like write everybody back there's many people who's texting me who's i'm not responding to just let y'all know that i see it like you know i see it just in my dms even though you know i can't respond i'm letting y'all know that i see it like i see it it's definitely being seen, and it's definitely highly appreciated. And it's definitely so much love that I have for everybody that's been checking on me and, you know, making sure that I'm good. Recently, a well-known public figure out of New York has been making her rounds on social media. Seems she's been having snitching allegations after recently being sentenced to only a year in prison as part of her plea for a RICO indictment. Today, we discuss who this woman is, her recent charges, her allegations, her story, and her plea agreement. And hopefully, we can clear up some of those rumors. So before we go over this one, remember, I don't give you no way. Damn, sorry, I look thicky hair, boy. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Sorry, I look thicky hair in that dread, boy. I ain't gonna lie. Boy, y'all see them thigh, boy? Boy, what? And her plea agreement. And hopefully, we can clear up some of those rumors. So before we go over this one, remember, I don't give you the I just give you the story. Fuck so with that being said, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. We'll jump right to it. So the first thing we should talk about, family, is 5-9 Brim. It's an alleged game where 18 people based out of New York was indicted in 2020. So I know you're probably wondering, what is 5-9 Brim? 5-9 Brim game was a set of blood street game formed in Los Angeles, California in the early 1970s. In the 1990s, certain individual sets of blood street gangs, including the Five Nine Brams, began operating on the East Coast of the U.S., including New York, under what's known as United Blood Nation, also known as UBN. Members and associates with the Five Nine Bram Gang broke away from UBN and began operating under New York Blood Bram Army, also known as NYBBA. We go deep inside. Despite having different names and being comprised of different sets, NYBBA, included the 59 brands, maintained common tattoos, communication codes, languages, gestures, and of course, all members were the color red. According to a 46 page indictment in 2020, 59 Brim did multiple acts like murder, shooting, robberies, and violent attacks on rivalries. They operated in Manhattan, Bronx, Queens, and Brooklyn, New York. They allegedly sold drugs to fund power and wealth for the crew. From 2011 to February of 2020, Southern District New York concluded these 18 defendants conspired in the RICO. In this indictment, they have a couple of murders and a couple of attempts. Let's go over it. One of the murders happened on January 11, 2020. Jamar Simmons, a.k.a. Showoff, and Darren Goodman, a.k.a. Hanson, killed Jason Purse, may he rest in peace. It was located at the 1441 Watson Ave in Bronx, New York. Apparently, that happened for rank and power. It was a fight outside a liquor store that turned deadly. Jamal Purse was only 36 years old. It happened at around 10.30 p.m. He was shot in the head and chest. Once again, rest in peace and love and condolences to his family. The person was killed in September 28, 2019. Willie Evans, a.k.a. Mills, and Jameer Simmons, a.k.a. Showoff, had killed a man that go by the name of Bradford Minson. 
in the Quintana Park area in the Bronx, New York. He was only 22 years old, and he too was shot in the head and back and chest. Damn. May he rest in peace and love condolences Damn. to his family. Jay Simmons and Goodman was the shooters to gain rank. According to the indictment, it was an attempt in 2018 with the defendants. Javarius Jenkins, a.k.a. J. Biz, for rank. He did another attempt in 2019. This time he was caught, according to the indictment. Now, the real reason we did this video and elaborated on the 5-9 Brent game indictment is because of the highest ranking female in this game, allegedly, according to the indictment, happens to be the best friend of a well-known, talented musician, Cardi B. Producers, if you struggle finding songs and samples that work for you, then you have to check out this plugin. It's called. I ain't gonna lie to it. I want to be a white girl. I ain't gonna lie. Look, look, look. Hey, let me let me speak. I think I want me a white girl. Like black girl, cool and all, but I don't know. I gotta step out of my comfort zone. I need me a little uh, white girl, but. I ain't on that goddamn get out shit. I ain't going out like that. I'm not finna go see your mama and your daddy. Fuck no. You got me fucked up. Fuck you think this shit is. Get out. I know I'm an African nigga, but I ain't African that nigga like that. Nigga Daniel Ulu, Ulu Walker. I don't know what nigga name. Daniel something. The nigga off get out. I ain't going out like, oh, but he yeah. ain't. But I do want me a white girl. You feel me? So I might have got that, got that, got that on 800 credit score. I might be like, hey, baby, go give me that SRT, motherfucker. She gonna go get that motherfucker from me. You feel me? SRT on the way, man. I ain't gonna lie. I gotta find me a little vibe that gonna give me an SRT. Find me a little sugar mama or something like that. Give me an SRT. Shit, I might just about look for me, got that on an old, old lady. Like, sugar mama, give me an SRT, got that blow up on YouTube. It's like, yeah. I'm him. Yeah, I just got the SRT. Deep down, nigga don't even know. I got a whole sugar mama right here. Fuck you talking about. Real name, Net Respace, a.k.a. Stop Brent. Power, I can't lie, it got me weak. Open fresh up out the shower. She look good enough to eat. And he doesn't hit me up by 11 o'clock. At that point, you did a no corner show. And you're fired. And by 11.01, <laughs> I'm hiring for your position. That's that's just the way it works. That's 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 how I see life. Stop <laughs> Brent is a member of the 5-9 brands. Recently, she came out and said this. Yeah, but yeah, I'm sentenced. I'm dropping my transcript. And I'm just letting people know there's no there's no backtracking. There's, there's never no backtracking. Like, everybody who was talking shit, popping shit, putting information out on me, false information out on me, there's no coming back. There's no coming back. Like, I'm sorry. Shut like, the fuck I don't up, hear, bro. I'm sorry because real niggas deal with paperwork. And I'm never going to let somebody, like, like, shame and down talk me for anything. I, I don't even like hearing dumb hoes talk, bro. I'm not going to lie. I don't get no fuck, bro. Shut the fuck up. He ain't talking about shit. Shit talking about dumb ass shit, bro. What the fuck? He ain't talking about nothing. The fuck you talking about? And one thing I'm never going to do also is let anybody on this internet or anybody in real life make me feel bad for getting less time while still staying at 10 toes. Nobody's going to make me ever feel bad about something like that. Ever. Like, I'm never going to feel bad about that. That's what I ain't gonna lie, I, I got a little issue. I'm kinda hard of hearing, like, I don't be listening to shit. I ain't gonna lie. I don't be listening to nothing. What the hell she talking about? I'm asking y'all, I, I don't know, like, I'm listening, but at the same time, this shit ain't talking about nothing. Like, like if a motherfucker talking and I don't give a damn what they talking about, and it just sound dumb as fuck, it goes through one ear and the other ear. Like, I got a bad habit of that. Like, I'm that nigga that I hung your ass, huh, 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 what you said, what you said, I'm, I'm the nigga that hung your ass to death, I'm the nigga that be like, what you said your ass to death, I'm like, cause I don't be listening, I don't know why, I just be in my own little world, so, sometimes motherfuckers be looking at me, I be looking at them, they'll be talking to me, I'm talking to them, and I don't be knowing what the hell they talking about, but I'm just, you ever just responded to some shit and you don't even know what the hell nigga said, nigga had come up to me like, yeah bro, man, I just went on this little, but I just hit for 20 behind, I be like, yeah, I, I I don't know. That's just me. I don't know. I, I got to start listening more. I got to get my listening skills up. 
I don't know if I, cause I be in that warehouse too much, too much, and then you fuck it on my ears. I think that that might be what it is. I be in the warehouse too much, and he be fucking on my ears, so I don't be listening. That why, man. Fuck that job, man. That why I'm trying to get rich out there. YouTube shit, so I don't got to work no goddamn warehouse job. That shit ain't talking about nothing. Fuck that job. We have sentence. I want me to go to jail so bad. And the thing is, I feel oh. like this guy never had nothing to say about. Oh, she talking about jail? Some jail shit? I don't know. Damn, shot. You too pretty to be talking about jail shit. Shut the fuck up and shake that ass, like. Stop talking about jail. Stop talking about these gang shit. Shake that ass. Like, eh. Y'all pretty good just, just when we on Instagram talking around and like, ho, shake that ass. Like, shut the fuck up and shake that ass. I don't want to hear you talk. Shake that ass. I don't, I don't give a fuck with any time. Just shake that ass, ho. Like, like, I'm like, hey, 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 shake that ass, shake that ass, shake that ass. But y'all ass over here got down just rambling. Nobody give a fuck what you talking about. Say that at home. God damn. About me. Y'all can't call me broke. You can't call me ugly. You can't call me a bum. You can't call me pussy. So the one thing that y'all haters has or clout chasers has something to sit, sit there and run with, y'all taking the shit and y'all trying to run with it. You feel me? Y'all trying to run with it. There's, like I said, there's, there's, no, there's, no, there's no coming back. And shout out to my lawyer, but also shout out to my friend. That paid three hundred and fifty thousand dollars for that lawyer. You feel me? While all y'all was having regular, you know, legal aids. Yeah, I had a paid lawyer. Thank you to my friend. Thank you, Cardi. Shout out to you. You feel me? Shout out to a real one. I want me to go to jail. Man, so shut the fuck up and say that. Ass. I don't give a fuck who you talking about. What, man? Ass, man. Free you, like I hope you don't go to jail or none of that. Like now, nah, sir, you you very pretty and shit like that. I don't know what you mean, so I hate when shit happen to pretty girls. But what I had to grow up and understand, shit happen for a reason, man. Like I just feel bad for pretty girls and shit, but nah, it's like man, I see why she be happening to your ass. I remember mean, one time I pulled up on a little bit, pretty a little bit, big got scars on her face. I had to ask I feel bad as shit, boy. I was sad as hell, boy. I feel bad as hell. And the bitch did some little weird shit. The bitch just a weird little bitch. And I'm like, man, I see why you got your ass whooped. I see why you got your ass whooped now. Like, like, man, I can't feel bad for these hoes, boy. Like, shot ass was so pretty. Then somebody put them paws on. Beats their ass, like. And she used to always act like she used to be ready to fight him off. I'm like, now, nah, so it's like, why are you trying to fight? Like, now, nah, so you too pretty to be doing all that fighting and shit. So somebody put them paws on her head, pink, pink, pink. Left a scar on her face, you feel what I'm saying? I'm like, damn, I feel bad. And then come to realize, like, now, nah, I don't feel bad for your ass. Bitch, you deserve that shit. You, you need to get your ass whooped. You, you needed that ass whooping. Yeah. Fuck you talking about. The and the real reason she did it was from one of the indictments that was filed February 14th, 2020. On that indictment, it was 15 pages. And they mentioned 959 Brim members, but details everyone involved in it except Sal Brims. He was recently sentenced, as you just heard, to just one year in jail for a RICO. And people say she told. But on February 21st, 2024, Sal Brim had accepted a plea deal. Now, before we go over that, Let's give a rundown on who Stop Brim is. Now, Stop Brim is a mother of one, and according to her PSI, she had a rough childhood growing up. Stop was a victim of physical abuse as a kid by her mom. They were, according to Stop lawyer, inflicted to cause the maximum pain. They also claim Star father did nothing to protect her. She grew up protecting her younger sisters. Here's where the details of the PSI come in in handy. Star was only 12 years old when she joined the Five Nine Brim Blood Gang, and over time, Stop Brim became the highest ranking female at 5'9 Brim. She claimed to have joined the gang to have a safe haven from the abuse at her home. In 2019, Star Mom had stopped drinking after it was discovered that she had cancer. Now family, pay attention, because this is where you make the judgment whether you feel Star had told or not. I'm just here to present the facts and you guys make that decision on your own at the conclusion. Star had acknowledged after being released from federal custody in 2019, that she authorized the slashing of a woman who had been a part of the gang while Star was in prison and who had violated gang rules. Although 
according to her lawyer, those papers didn't go through, and Starr didn't know any involvement about the slashing until after she was released. She admit to calling the shots. The next offense is when her own best friend came. Oh, damn. Oh, she like that? She calling shots? Oh, shit. I ain't no cyber like that. She ordered and hits the nigga get stabbed and shit. I ain't no shot at all like that. Uh-uh. That twins, ages 21 and 23, one used to be the girl. Oh my the god, they bad as fuck. Was attacked for allegedly sleeping with Star Brim, that's friend husband, who was a successful rapper. Offset. It was August 29th, 2018. While Star was in federal prison, other gang members had a dispute with non gang members at a strip club and asked Star permission to assault these two women. She gave permission. And this is according to her plea agreement. She admitted to. Also, quick Nicki Minaj for on Queen Radio talking about this incident. But she... There is electromagnetic energy in that pyramid between 206... But she had a debacle with Cardi B. They get money. Now they can't get no money, so who's stopping bags? Cause you got grown ass fucking men showing up to where the fuck they at and where they work at. They can't feed their kids, they can't feed their fucking family. Shut the fuck up. I ain't, bro, I ain't trying to, I ain't trying to hear him no bitch, bro. I, I can't, I can't, bro. I can't listen to no bitch get loud, get to arguing and shit. I ain't trying to hear that, like. No, I'm not trying to hear all that shit. Women and women, period. Oh, cause she not black. Cause she refers to you black women. I ain't trying to hear that shit, bro. I ain't gonna lie to y'all. I ain't gonna, I don't wanna hear that bitch talking. Roaches! Now it's important to note that that case was closed as resolved in criminal court. From start to the- I don't, I don't like when the hoes get loud, get the, get the like, arguments, man. What? <sighs> Bitch, get gone, get gone, ho. I don't got time for no hoes getting loud. Like, I, don't, I don't like all that shit. I don't like that loud shit. I ain't gonna lie. Especially a female? So I get from, bro. I, I go mute on the hoes. I kick her out, but not fin, not not fin. This to your ass. Five hundred eighteen right. case. She was only sentenced to fifteen months in jail and three years. A she bad release. though. And that's sentence locked up. She bad as hell. She was released in two thousand and nineteen. I just want to kiss her. Became pregnant with her first known oh. child in May two thousand and nineteen. So oh yeah. my god, she bad as fuck. I just want to kiss her. I just want to kiss her everywhere. I want to kiss on her face, on her ass, everywhere. Fuck you, tell me. Fuck you mean? Just two weeks before her birth. I don't kiss her. She was arrested on Rico charges. I don't want to like kiss you on your lips and on your thighs. I don't want to kiss you on your lips and on your thighs. Ooh, 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 she's so bad at four, boy. She bad. I don't this shit, boy. And start brim lost her purse. Just two weeks. I ain't gonna lie to him. I gotta get rich out of the YouTube shit so I can start fucking with hoes like that. I mean, I mean, oh my bad, females. I'm trying to get rich out of the YouTube shit so I can fuck females like that, man. Like, I don't want to fuck with her like, and my fuck want to just DM her right now. She responding, you feel what I'm saying? Like, but these hoes, they don't even respond to a nigga. Like, I sign the whole DM, they don't even respond to a nigga, man. They just be like, man, this nigga lame in here. This nigga ain't got no man. This nigga ain't got no followers in there. Like, man, that way y'all gotta pipe me up, bro. Y'all gotta pipe me up, nigga. Like, come on, boy. Y'all see me doing my thing, you know what I'm saying? Y'all see me doing my thing, I'm working hard. Like, I'm trying to get that money. I'm trying to get you right, K. I'm trying to take care of my folk. You feel me? Like, I'm trying to y'all handle the bidding me. Stand on bidding me. Fuck you, tell me. Fuck these hoes. These hoes come last. But, yeah, I want a female like them. Fuck you, tell me. Like them. Bad. Due to COVID. April 4th, 2020, she lost her dad. April 16th, 2020, she lost her mom. Damn. They both rest in peace. And love and condolences to their families. Star Brim gave birth to her only child in March of 2020. And she said then on after, she gave up that lifestyle to raise her child. Star had pled guilty to five counts as you see above. Star had to turn herself in before 2 p.m. on July 1st, 2024. She served one year and one day. She'll be released if everything goes well. July 2nd, 2025. She will also be on supervised release for three years. Now, I took a screenshot. It's three documents that sealed in the vault no one would be able to look at. Star Brim released her paperwork, but it was quickly deleted and no one else seems to upload it. You guys got to take it for what you believe based on the information that's public and facts. I want to say rest in peace to all the victims that we discussed in this story. Love and condolences to their families. 
This was the story of the highest ranking female, 5'9 Grim Blood Gang member, who left that life after having her baby and sentenced to one year in jail on a Rico charge. Let me know how you guys feel about this one in the comments. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And today, I'll catch you guys on the next one. Sorry that bad, man. I, I'm, I'm a girl like her, but I already know girls like that come with a lot of shit, boy. Can I handle it? Hmm, I don't know. Shit, free her, though. Free shot, she on the way home. She gonna be home by the end of the year. They talking about she get out 2025. Hopefully, she home by the end of the year. You feel what I'm saying? Anyway, y'all like, comment, and subscribe. Yeah.